Yo guys, what's up? Let me know if you hear me. I'm just setting up, so please be patient. I'm, I've uh, booted up my PS5 for the first time in months, pretty much, so. <laughs> oh man, you already know what it is. Let me know if you hear me, though. Yo, Zach, was good, homie? Light Shadow Onyx, good to see you, fam. Do y'all hear me? Let me know. <laughs> Yo, Hurricane was good. Yo, mic check. I'm streaming for my PS5, so I definitely need y'all's help. Alright, thank you, Xavier. Appreciate you confirming for me. I do at least have a better headset that has a better microphone than uh, the PS5 headset that I used to use when I would stream from my PS5, so... I hope that is at least somewhat of an improvement, <laughs> respectably, considering what I got going on. Xeverus, it's good to see you, Hurricane, Light Shadow Onyx, Zach Hall, appreciate y'all pulling up, homies. Hey, my man, Dicky Doodles, what's good, fam? So I'm playing Metal Gear Solid 4 for the first time. Finally got that PS3, nice, nice, and let me tell you, you've got nothing on old man Snake's cheeks, oh yeah. Nah, you ain't lying. Man, old man Snake be keeping it in his shape. But yeah, just sitting up. I'm about to tweet it out. And then we gonna get started. But we gonna check this game out and see what's up. Show me the yams. <laughs> Yo, Silent Joker was good, fam. If you can, hit the like button. Really helps me out, y'all. As we, uh, we have this gathering. See what's up with Stellar Blade, baby. All right, let me tweet it out. Stop fucking around. It's always like a. It's always always a crazy ass event when um. When we stream it from the PS Five. <laughs> Holy shit. I know I don't know what to expect from this combat. It feel it, it from the sound of it, um, it sounds very interesting. So we'll see what's up. Copy. Alright, alright, let me see. Oh, I posted this bitch. Let's go. Yo, Astro, what's good? Yeah, <laughs> Cassie actually set her alarm clock. Oh man, that that last night, y'all gonna have to forgive me for that one. That was a straight L. At least the show was still good though. It's still a quality show. I was actually surprised that um, as many people pulled up when I did stream. I saw oh shit, five hundred people pulled up for this. Wow, thank y'all. Y'all made it an event nonetheless. So thank you guys for that. 
um, Jacob, I woke up two hours late for uh, my podcast. <laughs> but we still ran it at 10 p.m. instead of 8 p.m., the usual time. I'm not going to lie, the 10 p.m. time wasn't too bad. Yeah, I kind of, I took an L. <laughs> Yo, Dicky Doodles, you funny. I hope it includes that too. Um, you know, genuine. No, not that fake shit that people be running with. Yo, undisputed king Nate, what's good, bro? It's good to see you. I hope you're doing well. I'm chilling, bro. Having a chill Friday. But how are you been? I feel like I haven't talked to you in a little minute. Always love kept catching up with y'all, seeing what y'all been up to. So let me know. The yams be yamming, Delta. That's what I love to hear. All right, so got this ready. Uh, tweeted that out. You know what, let me post this bitch in. I'm post that bitch right there. The yams, let's go. Do I sound okay? Let me know, just to be sure, because I'm using a different headset. I'm using a better headset um, in terms of, of microphone quality. The uh, Corsair Virtuosos I hear have a pretty decent microphone in its own right for a headset. But if you can, guys, hit that like button. Helps me out. I appreciate y'all. All right. So I got this set up on my PC, I think. I think. And then all I have to do is get my tablet up so I can see y'all's comments. And then we, we fucking stellar. That's what it is, bro. We're going to be stellar in a minute. Hopefully... PlayStation don't fuck up on us. But we shall see. Alright. All right, I'm done on the PC side. About to take it over to the console. Maybe got 20 homies pulling up. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. I, I didn't make any announcement on any of this. So the fact y'all are here. I thank you. I was just like fuck it. We got this, this demo. I got free time. I'm chilling. I'm in a good mood. All the more reason to hang out with y'all on stream. Yo, my man, John Wolf pulling out. Yo, what's good, bro? Hope you're doing well. Are you going to play with one-handed mode on? Say what? Yo, son, I'll be rocking like that, dog. I know the Lemonade King rocks like that. He already established he ain't never finishing this game because, man, he going to be too busy beating his fucking meat. All right. Let me see. Um, let me switch this out real quick. All right, I think we're good to go. All right, I can see the chat. Ziggy stalking the shit out of me. Sounds about right. I'm just gonna plug in my phone just to make sure that shit don't die on me while we streaming. Alright, and we 
good. We good, man. Thank y'all for joining. Hanging out with me today. Damn, John so said John said he beat the demo and pre-ordered. Yeah, I pre-ordered a physical copy of this game. I'm hoping that I can get the digital upgrade. Uh, what I need you guys to help me out with is to make sure that the game audio and my voice, you know. Just make sure that the game audio doesn't, you know, overshadow my voice. If so, let me know and I'll just turn down the game. Ziggy, what are you looking at, bro? He's like, you really over here streaming right now. Well, you should be paying attention to me. final briefing. As of now, Airborne Squad 7 will exterminate the Alpha Nativas occupying District 3. Their objective is the capture or dispatchment of the Elder Nativa. Pods entering atmosphere. What the fuck is this bitch even saying? One minute until threshold is reached. Alright. I'm about to lower it a minute. Threshold has been surpassed. Activating shield. Yo, we hype for the ass physics, yo. Lewis was good. Lee was good. Yeah, Lewis, hope you're doing well, fam. I got this bitch on performance mode, so we're gonna see what's up. Hey, damn, what's good? Whoa. Okay, so far the presentation is pretty solid. Do I still sound too low or does this sound okay? If so, let me know. I can't I can't do anything about the sound right now until this cutscene is over. Volume's good on audio? Okay. Appreciate you, Dan. Oh shit. They wallin. Girl Eve about to have some bruised yams. Zero seven five three one. Pod landing complete. Removing physical shield. Opening hatch. The hatch. Come on. Come on. Oh shit. Oh no! Did I already fuck this up? I was not prepared. T Taki. Taki, you were right. Bruh, Taki are the things. chips that I eat. What the fuck? Take my hand. Let's go, baby! Uh, Lewis, we just started it up. We just... Like, this is the beginning beginning, you know? Alright, let's see what's up, man. This way to the bonus. We're in this bitch on, uh... You take the left. I'm about take to look around. Side. Nah, first thing I do is do the opposite of what I should be doing. That's how we roll. Whoa. I feel like when I press the button, it feels off. Okay, okay, strong attack. I feel I feel like by the time I hit it, like the response doesn't feel like on point, you know. Okay, there we go. 
Okay. I like the way they yo. Oh shit. The motherfuckers be oozing. Coordinates. Holy shit. Okay. I'm digging it so far. This reminds me of the intro of um Ghost of Tsushima. I don't remember if you guys know like shit was going wild in the intro of Ghost of Tsushima. That was close. Come here. Careful your jump. Alright, I'm looking around still. I'm curious, like I wanna see what's up. What the fuck is that? Don't go too far. Oh no, am I dying? I'm dying because- Bruh. Okay, I, I'm not gonna lie, I don't like that about games when you can't really look around. Alright, let's see. Hey, Doomslayer, good to see you, bro. Hope you're doing well. Happy, uh, Friday. Greg, happy Friday. You sent nothing but baddies to this planet. Fuck yeah, bro. That's- that's who gotta take care of business, man. Watch out! It's an unlisted yeah. Oh shit, it's tiny. I put, I'm not. Hold up, hold up. Uh, there we go. Oh shit, damn, double tap. Alright. Can I dash around? That's what I'm. Oh, okay, that's a dash. That ain't really much of a dash there, but. Ooh, okay, okay! Holy shit, alright. Great, let's go. Yo, someone on in my right. YouTube comments the other day was saying that Eve don't even have a big ass. I'm like, what the fuck? Are you are you blind? Thank you. No spoilers. There's more of them. All right, we got potions up in this bitch. Let's go. Got him. Oh shit! That double shit is fucking me up. These aliens is pretty wild, bro. Holy shit. Jin wasn't a baddie though. I mean Jin had a fat ass in his own right. I mean what? You secured. Invisible walls are lethal. Yeah, I don't like that about games. Like to me, one of my all-time favorite games is Dying Light 2. Because they just got rid of that concept entirely, you know? This might be the butt of all gaming. Oh shit, no! Yo, son! Holy shit! Okay, a little bit of stutter, a little bit of stutter. Don't stop! Keep moving, E. Yo, Rocky! What's good, brother? That was close. This isn't looking good. Let's go. I wonder if uh, the Lemonade King is even going to be able to finish this demo, let alone An alpha named beat the game. Let's Holy shit. Uh-oh. Homegirl's fucked up in the game. Ah! God damn. I've watched Death Wish 1, 2, and 3. I did not watch 4. <gasps> Fuck that. Death Wish 1 and 2 is awesome. Death Wish 3 is a fucking comedy. And I'm sure Death Wish 4 is no- No. No! The squad's life signs. Uh-oh. We're the only two left. Damn. Eve. Yo, Jacob, what's good, fam? Eve, pull yourself together. Taki? Listen to me. We yeah, haven't completed a bit mission. of an input delay on the... Now it's on the attacks. To see this mission through. Understand? 
Ethan says she's wearing too much clothing. I mean, this wouldn't be a problem if the fucking game was launching on PC as well, but we here, <laughs> you know? Like, it is what it is. Yo, Joe, what's good? Oh, this is just the demo, Joe. But, um, the demo is gonna carry over to the... Are you ready? To the official release, so... You can start the demo and expect, uh... To continue on. Oh shit. Holy fuck. Oh my god. Holy shit. These are some ugly motherfuckers. Oh my god. Alright, I need some help. Oh my god. Holy fuck. I have to get used to this shit. Damn. Can you block their this dude's attack? Oh yeah, you can. Holy fuck. Got him. Alright, I'm getting used to it. Yo, I feel like there's this weird delay. Could be me though. I'm fucking retarded. Oh my god. Oh my god, got it. Oh my god. Holy shit. Oh my god. Holy fuck. Get up. Damn. Oh, you can't cancel. So you really gotta... Aw, oh, man. Now, nah, this shit kinda tough. Oh, shit. Yo! Okay, okay, okay. Okay. I'm oh, shit! Yo, I like that shit. Give me some style in this bitch. It wasn't an alpha, but it was a Might song. be wrong for this, but I prefer tacky. You fought well. Now, that's not a wrong you answer, bro. Taki's pretty. You were all together. But then... Which Luffy uh, was good, homie said cheeks. The damage to your body frame is serious. No, that's not a wrong answer, bro. I ain't mad at you. We have to find the supply camp. What's the narrative story? Now, this seems like a futuristic end-of-the-world scenario. I hear something. Eve! Post-apocalyptic. Eve, are you all right? I've been kind of avoiding narrative-related stuff, so I'm just kind of going in raw, baby. When you said dead or alive, Dicky Doodles, I immediately just uh, thought of dead or alive, you're getting some cheeks. What the fuck is even that? Yo, they definitely came up with some unique enemy designs in this game. This is yes, definitely man. not available on the Xbox. This is, uh, at least for now, PlayStation exclusive. I'll buy the bitch twice. If I enjoy the game. So far, so good. Oh, shit, no! Yo! Aw, oh, man. Fucking hell. No! Man, I like Taki, too. Eve! Get out of here. Damn, bro, this game is brutal. What the fuck? Man, this game is brutal as hell! I'm sad. Taki was a fucking G, man! R.I.P! Fuck!
F in the chat. Doctor? Yeah, we running the F in the chat. Drop the F in the chat. It's quiet. Still, make sure to stay cautious. Oh man, it says Sony, it's baby! What's good with you, I mean? Hope you're doing well. Love when you post little emotes. Now, get ready. I'll be supporting with the drone. Hey, Joe, appreciate you pulling up. Thank you so much, fam. Joe said, you, you gotta listen to Joe, man. Joe knows, knows what's up. He said, thanks, Cage. Yes. Gotta go. This like, share, and subscribe, heathen. Hell yeah, brother. It was also known as a truly colossal city. Something is falling from the sky. A strange sensation. This must be Earth's rain. Great. Went out like a G, bro. She saved we the main the character. Silent the Street. Alright. Adam is a scavenger from Zion. He saved Eve's life from. Everyone's saving Eve's life, holy shit! From an unidentified. Natiba? Though Eve did not trust him at first, Adam suggests that he and Eve work together, and so they arrive at Ido 7. Alright, so, ooh, Tacky got a whole fucking. Tacky's the commanding officer of the 7th Airborne Squad. Yo, Tacky was a beast, bro! They say that in the colony's combat simulations, her speed was unmatched. Her name is Taki for a reason. What is Taki? What does it even mean? All I know is Taki's the snack. And I'm sure to some people she certainly is a snack. Seventh Airborne Squad gets obliterated by Naitibas while entering Earth's atmosphere. However, the mission is still a go. Taki finds Eve and intends to regroup with their squad. Yet the Natiba's onslaught practically wipes out Taki's squad. To make matters worse, an unidentified Natiba strikes without warning, leaving both Taki and Eve at death's door. In a desperate moment, Taki sacrifices herself to save Eve. There is still life in the flames of hope. Man, R.I.P. R.I.P. Yeah, everyone gotta save Eve's cake, man. It happens. We all need help, right? Uh, cause here, here's the enemies. Yeah, they have some interesting enemy designs. Uh, it's, uh, it's definitely a good variety off rip. That's cool to see. I guess Taki like Takion? I don't know what that means. It, it's mandatory that you die for the cake, I guess. You know, it is what it is. I know Razan been fucking with it pretty heavy. Falling to break. Be carefully. Yes, yeah, definitely feeling like Bayo right now. Feel like we're running a Bayo chapter. I like the the world design. It's pretty solid. I'm digging it. Something. Oh shit. It's coming. <laughs> Ooh, I like that. Oh shit, Allie. All right, area is clear. Press to acquire items. Oh shit! Hold on, let me go back. Yeah, well, Johnny, what's good, fam? Doctor Animation says, "Let be that game will not be played by big YouTubers of old guard." I never understood why they never do brand safety. Oh yeah, they're pussies, man. They, they're sold out. They're fucking pussies. It is what it is. We ain't about that here. 
You already know what it is. That's why you definitely like, bro. You, you can have like your big, your big um streamers that you support and shit. You gotta support your small streamers too. Cause at the end of the day, I, I don't give a fuck. I play whatever the fuck I want. I'm not here trying to get um. I'm I'm really not here trying to get kids uh to fucking watch my streams. Encrypted code in the memory stick. That's a security code, a type of entry permit. I mean, I do play Fortnite because I like Fortnite, but I'm definitely not trying to get a kid's audience. Fuck that. A lot of the the people that watch my content are in like the late twenties, mid thirties range, which is cool. I prefer that. Yo. IG, what's good, fam? What's up? How's the game? Wanna buy it? Um, so far so good. I'm digging it. I'm still getting used to the controls. It's a little bit weird. Try entering but it just takes time, like, like any other game. That's high action. Oh wait, what the fuck is the code? Was I supposed to remember a code? Hold on. What the hell? Remembering things? Oh, it's over, guys. It's fucking over. Whoa, you can run around naked? Hey, yo, son. <laughs> you can really take that shit off. That's wild. Does it give you a boost? It's, it has, like, a star rating on it. Was I supposed to really remember something? Game of the year. <laughs> yeah, apparently I should be offended or some shit. Like, bro, I'm not even, like... You know, you guys already know me. Like, bro, I'm a tomboy. I wear guys' clothes. I don't feel bothered by characters like this. This is cool. Like, bro, do shit like this. Like, bro, like, my, one of my all-time favorite video game characters is Bayonetta. Like, bro, Bayonetta is a crazy dope-ass bitch. Like... What's so bad about any of this, you know? It's wild. People really, uh... They, they, there's a lot of women in the gaming space now that don't like games for what they are and also do not have any fucking self-confidence at all. They're fucking losers. What the hell? Oh, shit. Well, I could cheat? Fuck yeah, bro, I'm cheating. Man, you know we cheat. Let's go. Yeah, 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 yeah! Um, I know that the people that did the soundtrack for this... I forget what else they did, but apparently... Um, they're known for, for doing good, like... Good video game music. Tomboys are real women. Fuck yeah. Tomboys are real women with good taste! That's how we roll. Oh shit, you can swim around? Oh, that's cool. Okay. Okay, the water physics is pretty on point. Okay. Oh, you could dive underwater. Oh, nice. Hold on. Let me get under here. Pause. Oh, shit. Oh, we got treasure under here. Fuck yeah, dog. Let me get that. Alright. Alright. We got it. Let's get out of here. Alright, we got the bag. We got the treasure. Let's go. Yo, Dope Fit, what's good, fam? Why she built like resigned? What the fuck? Who are we talking about? Hell yeah, I cheat, bro. Fuck all this puzzle related shit. I, I ain't about all of that. Y'all already know I don't like puzzles. Come 
Come on, bitches. Mm. Y'all getting at work. There's a legion camp in a place like this. Yeah, these controls are definitely interesting. They're gonna take a little minute to get used to. But I don't think that they're bad. They're just a little different. Gotta listen to my man I mean he says hit the like button. Smash that shit. Smash the like button like you smashed Eve, alright? We using vending machines now? Yo, Brandon, was good? Man, PlayStation took away our PC version, bro. It's good. The one positive is that I do get to have a physical copy of this game, which is important to me. But yeah, it does kind of suck that there is no, uh, no physical copy. What are you gonna do? I mean, uh, there is no PC version. But if I like the game, I'll buy it again. I don't give a fuck. I'm about to get Ghost of Tsushima day one, a second time. Aji said, I've heard that if uh, dress less, she'll take more damage. So I guess stars re uh, represent the difficulty. Of oh, I got you, I got you. Yeah, the same artist from Nier. There you go, swag bag. Appreciate you looking that up for me. Man, see, y'all are fucking beasts. Shout out to y'all. I can't buy anything. Oh, I don't have enough currency. Oops. Reading, what the fuck is that? Man, fuck that. I mean, you know what I had to do? Just, to, I had to update this PS5, bro. I had to. Oh my god. Oh shit. Okay. Did oh so he pulled up right after this shit went down. Alright. What's wrong? Uh, it's nothing. Dwayne said thanks for the reminder on hitting the like button. Always forget on lashes. Nah, that's all good, bro. I appreciate you doing it, man. It does, you know anything that help helps out content creators, you know, I appreciate you. But, it, you know, every little bit helps, man. Oh my god, can I just stop right here? Thank you. So, I appreciate you, fam. Y'all know me, I, I don't ask for much, but definitely hitting the like button, showing up, like, bruh, you are more than appreciated. Change the survival tree? Oh shit. Select perfect dodge. Am I gonna make my perfect dodge skill like better? Cause I suck at that shit. What? Oh, press. I'm bad at the fucking um, parry system. I'm always bad at parry systems in every fucking game. My reaction time is dog shit. I still like games with parry systems in it, though. So, it's a necessary evil. I'm still in the mourning process of having to put my 11-year-old dog down. Oh man. Yo, Black Metal Gamer, bro. My, my sincerest, like, condolences, man. Um, you know, I can't really... I can't really speak to it because I never had that situation. My dog that I had a few years back, she she had passed away in her sleep, um, in the house. So, you know, I, she was she was just good. Like she seemed good. The next day, she didn't wake up. So, 
never had to put down an animal, but, you know, nonetheless, I sympathize with your situation, you know. Be strong, man. What the fuck is he meant? Yeah, the enemy's got no ass, yo. Yeah. Holy fuck. These, these enemies looking like fucking Aloy and Ellie out here, I man. Holy shit. What is this? What are we doing here? Oh shit, there we go. I like the little effects we got going on. Yeah, man, thank you so much for sharing out the, the stream. Oh, it's one of the Legion's old supply boxes. Hey, nice, nice, nice. Let me get all that. Let me get all that. Oh, you can hold down to select a desired potion. Alright. Yo, Dwayne, Dwayne, big facts, the ESG enemies, yeah, yeah, fight the well, ESG legit, motherfuckers, so yeah. Be an issue. Make sure to take Yo, that's why I love hanging out with y'all, y'all really be holding it down, holy shit. Yo, Ice Queen, what's good, fam? Happy Friday. Let me see. I'm actually curious about the, uh... About the general performance of the game. Let me see. Let me put it on balance to see what's up. You know what? Balance still feels... Like, the frame rate still feels solid on balanced. I'm about to leave this alone. Leave it on balanced. The visuals are a little cleaner. You see the rapids below. A little bit. If you fall, it's over. Yeah, it's a Korean studio. Those enemies are all ESG members. Anita is the final boss. Yeah! You gonna really inspire us to kick ass and take names, huh? Jump and hang from bars. Oh shit, no! I missed. Hey, let's go, let's go. Eve showing off her skills, let's go. Did you just say there's... No, there is a physical copy of the game. I, I pre-ordered it. You can pre-order it now. I'm just, there's no, there's no physical deluxe edition, which is... Which is why, like... That's my only issue with this so, thus far. Um, I'm hoping that there's like... A, a digital deluxe upgrade available at launch. What the fuck? Oh my god, holy shit. Alright, revive. Get the first L. Yo, Korea don't, bruh. Korea be on point. South Korea know what they're doing. Oh shit, perfect dodge, let's go. Me and locking on to enemies is just never gonna be a thing. It just never feels like beneficial to me, but I could be wrong. I could be wrong. I'm going backwards. Oops. Man, South Korea giving motherfuckers what they want. Oh shit. What? Aw oh, man, I tried the perfect dodge! Until BlackRock buys them shares. I heard that that this company's going public. That's a fucking problem. I'm not gonna lie. Let's 
company needs to to make like fucking. They need to make like inbreds and keep it in the family. Oh, bruh, ain't good. Man, fuck you, you fucking bitch. Yo, K-pop is flames. Dwayne, me, me and Perry ain't a thing. Here we go. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Damn, I feel like there's this weird delay. I could be wrong. Like I said, I'm garbage at parrying. I'm not gonna sit here and pretend. I normally block punches with my face. That's how I pretty much conduct myself. Oh my god. Fuck you, bitch. Oh my god. Fuck my life. See, I'm trash at parrying. This ain't nothing new. Oh my god. Fuck, yo, that shit fucking melts your health. Oh yeah. Motherfucker said this shit was a half hour long uh, demo. I said, not for me, motherfucker. Not for me. You already know what it is. You gonna learn today? Oh my god, you fucking cunt. I like the destruction in the game, it's pretty solid. I keep going the wrong way with your dumbass. Yeah, um, Dwayne, this is gonna carry over to the main game. Back up, back up, back up! Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm about to go and get another health. Fuck that. Yo, Dante was good. Do I rest to like regain health? Is that like a cheat that I can use? I still don't have enough. A pulse grenade? Yo, smoke, that sounds a little sus. I ain't gonna lie to you, dog. I wanna know where I live? Holy shit. You good, brother? Holy fuck. I just need to know, are you good? You always take dodge mechanic over parry mechanic? That's what's up. Hey, we, yo, we about to hit 50 likes? Yo, son, y'all are fucking beasts. Thank you. Alright, we're about to get it right this time, I think. <laughs> Yo, Sasha, what's good? I really hope they don't take long to put this on PC. Imagine the mods that Nexus will ban- Yo, Nexus been on some fuck shit. They really have been on some fuck shit, and I've been- I, I've covered their bullshit. Um, since- since Spider-Man came to PC. Oh my god. Fuck, dude. Alright, getting better. 
Back up, back up, back up. Oh my god. I thought I did. Ooh, okay, okay. Holy shit. Man, Eve is a fucking G. Holy shit. I got no more health. But, um, I didn't die. Holy shit. Yo, Spectre was good, dog. Oh, they be hiding little boxes around here. Okay. Uh, fuck me. I probably should have used that move on them, that other motherfucker up. I'm digging this music. They should have got Black Pick to make some music for this. Hey, Tracy, what's good? Yeah, so far so good. It's pretty solid. I'm still getting used to controls and stuff, but... I'm liking what's going on right now. Oh, shit. What the fuck? Hold on. Uh. What? Oh, shit. Hey, we got him. Hey, we got him. Yeah, boy, yeah, yeah. Need the soundtrack? Yeah, I hope they put this bitch on Spotify. I would definitely listen to this. This is like really. Yo, my man, the coach. What's good with you, brother? Appreciate you pulling up. We got 50 likes. Y'all a fucking beast. Thank you. Gear. All right, so we got a new outfit. Is there really gonna be something better than Eve's cheeks? Hold up. What? What did we get? That's a new, new gear piece. Oh, oh shit! Hold up. Combo attack enhancer gear. Ooh. Okay. Okay, I like that. Alright, I could dig it, man. And you definitely gotta look around in this game. They'll leave, like, little things for you. Alright, so the only time that they leave something in the car if it's, like, flashing. Definitely need more health. The hair animation is incredible. Yeah, the, the hair animation is pretty solid. It reminds me of Bayonetta. The queen of hair. Yeah, so far this has been a pretty solid game if you're into sort of hack and slash games. It's, um... The controls are a little bit weird. But it's definitely trying to be its own thing, which I can appreciate as well. We gonna get used to it. We gone. Very dependent on the parry system from what I've seen thus far. What is this? Can we break this stuff? I like the atmosphere. Like talking about post apocalyptic uh, Oh my god, I'm about to fucking butcher that. But like a post-apocalyptic sci-fi sort of video game. Like this is this is pretty interesting. I'm liking um the South Korean developers take on it. And this game is right around the corner, which is cool. If I if I hit this, will I die? Oh my god, oh my god. Ooh, okay, okay. And I'm playing on balance mode, guys. I'm not even playing on performance right now. So the balance mode is pretty solid. I'm not gonna lie. This is like the first game I played on PS5 where I haven't like when there was like three options and the balance mode was acceptable to me. Huh? Wait, there's a fusion cell. Where? Let's open the car's hood. Okay. And oh, there we are. <laughs> oh, surprise! 
Yo, Dwayne said, uh, I'd give her a go. Hey, yo. It's a high energy compressor. I'm sure you would. Thanks to that, Earth's night isn't dark yet. Oh, it's the previous generation of the Infinity Cell. Yo, I'm forgiving what's good, sure bro. He says, that. Stellar Peach. Very valuable. Aji said, fun fact, the person who designed the female characters is by a woman who is married to the director of Stellar Blade. I actually did hear that. And it's funny because, like, they constantly give, like, female designers shit about making these... Oh, shit. Fuck. This dude caught me off guard. God, I did not carry any of it. Fuck me, bruh. Well, I didn't die. That's a positive. But, um, they constantly give female game designers shit about making sexy female characters. Like, they constantly do that shit. And they talk about, like, oh, supporting women. Y'all are fucking anti-female, if anything, you fucking cocksuckers. Not for nothing, bro. Hold on. Let me switch this up. I need some hella. They are so full of shit. It's the same thing with Bayonetta. Bayonetta's character is, is created by a female designer. The same as E. And they gave Bayonetta bullshit for fucking over a decade, bro. Stop pretending that you, you support women. You're fucking full of shit. All, all these motherfucking activists do is support themselves. They are lying fucking cocksuckers. Not for nothing. Ah, uh, I'm sorry, um, AJ. My apologies, I'll try to get that correct. I try to do my best. Um, me and reading aren't necessarily, uh, we're, we're not necessarily consistent by any means. But, AJ, appreciate you, bro. Yo, honey, what's up, fam? Wait, we got codes? No, not the codes! Oh, I actually need to find a code. Yes, yes, coach. I didn't die. That's a positive. I was getting... I was getting wrecked when I first started. Oh my gosh. I had to settle in a little bit. I'm still... I'm still trying to get there. Alright. What the fuck am I gonna do here? Oh shit. Investigate. Ew. The memory sticks fried. Then what is, what is the... I, yeah, I, there ain't nothing in here right now. Alright, so how the fuck am I gonna get over there? Oh no, we can just go through here? No, 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 this is where I came from. Ugh. Ugh, them textures look nasty, I ain't going front. Search the area for the code. Alright, let's see, let's see, let's see. But it won't even let me put in a code. That's the problem. Something has to happen before that. E209? Would that be it? Vanya, what's good, fam? We chillin', we playing the Stellar Blade demo, which carries over to the main game, so this is essentially the beginning of Stellar Blade. Long hair and Heidi. <laughs> Peach Netta. Yo. Yo, Bayonetta 1 is still a game I love going back to. Oh my god, what a fun fucking game. What a fun fucking game, guys. It is... I'm kind of sad that, that Bayonetta 3 is kind of fucked up. 
But Bayonetta 1 and 2, bro, fucking heat. I don't know what I'm doing here. I don't know what to do. Huh. Yo, my man, Gooch, was good, bro? I'm trying to figure this shit out right now. I like how her hair will drape over her. That's kind of interesting. Have to interact with the item code to activate the chess console. Yeah, I figured that. Alright, I guess we have to go back. Leave up out of here. Appreciate, appreciate the little tidbits, Sasha. Thank you. Alright, so. Oh shit. Shit is getting real. Are we gonna have a little boss fight? No. Oh shit. It's a trap. Oh shit. Run! Fuck that. Holy shit. Oh, Eve said, nah, we ain't running. I have to be careful. Motherfuckers is behind me. Oh my god. No, I died! Rip! Yeah, I don't mind, like, the little tips. Not outright spoilers and shit, but... I get frustrated sometimes, so little, little tips, little, you know, stuff. I appreciate it. At least the fucking um, checkpoints are pretty solid. Imagine I have to restart the whole fucking level after dying. You rat. It's a trap. Just the tip, Dwayne. Just the tip. Oh my god. Oh my god, I didn't see that bitch next to me. Hey. Uh, fuck y'all. Alright, handled that shit pretty well. Oh shit. Oh shit. I was not expecting that. God damn it! Oh, nice! God damn it, I thought I was gonna be able to perfect parry again. Alright, let me back up. Can't see. All right, there we go. Ooh, we got him. Okay. There is hope for me, guys. Where do we go now? This way. There are traces of markers left behind by the Legion. Yeah, honestly, swag bag. Um. Unreal Engine 4 is the best thing for, for PS5. That's just what it is. Like, PS5 is not prepared for Unreal Engine 5. This is what what the PS5 plays well. The PS6 is what's going to play Unreal Engine 5. Unreal Engine 5 games don't really fucking run well on, on PS5. I thought I fucking dodged it! What the fuck, bro? Oh shit, we got another... Yeah, no, that's true too, Sasha. You ain't lying about that. I just don't think there's gonna ever really be much of a point to AAA games on, on the current state of consoles. So. Oh 
Oh shit, what? Oh shit. What the hell? May your memories live on forever. All right, found one. Need two more. I'm really interested to see what. Um, the 5000 series graphics cards are going to be able to do, especially from a software standpoint. Because normally, guys, I don't know if you've seen the history, but normally the odd-numbered cards tend to be the true, like, upgrades. The even-numbered cards normally fucking suck. They're not extremely disappointing. Like, I really don't think that, that, aren't, that uh, the 4000 series is worth the fuck, really. Like, it has introduced features that developers don't even utilize. So, what the fuck is the point? So, to, to me, it's just nothing really worth the fuck with the 4000 series. Hopefully, the 5000 series really brings forth the power that we're looking for. And just uh, actual features that will be utilized very well cuz like the 3000 series was solid 2000 series is ass it's always the the even numbers that are ass guys so oh fuck no i didn't mean to do that But I'm on a, a 3080 right now, and I'm sticking with it until the 5000 series. Then, to be honest, you might build a, just a whole new rig. Um, maybe use some parts, because I could definitely still use my SSD from my my two terabyte from my current um, my current fucking setup. So there's some things I'll definitely carry over my uni fans. But I might gut my current PC for for some things, and then other things. No, just get new shit. Oh shit. Should I screenshot this? Well, I did anyway. think PS6 will have any serious competition? Honestly, the P the PS6's hand. main competition is PlayStation themselves. Scan complete. You have to cross here. Do you see the ladder behind me? Curious to see how far they get with the AI upscaling to the point it doesn't look blurry even at 1080p. Yeah, yeah, we're so spoiled now. Remember, remember we thought 1080p was the shit. Yo, we we thought 1080p was fucking sexy as shit. Now we're just like, man, fuck that 1080p, bro. That shit look blurry. All right, hold on one sec, guys. I must use the ladies' room.
Okay, guys, I've returned. Wait, you think that 60 hertz is blurry? Do you mean choppy? Because I don't see how a frame rate is blurry. It's choppy at 30 to me. 60 is fine. The only time, like... It's really the resolution, or if you put, like, the motion blur. Because at 60, you don't fucking need motion blur. Or... See, for me, I put the motion blur very low in the game. Because a little tiny bit of motion blur is nice. Um, it's not a bad thing, by any means. It's when the motion blur is just dominating, like, the entire view of the game. So, like, I think the max motion blur is 10 on here. I put it on 20. 20, we at 60, um, I think. I'm, I'm playing on balance. So a little tiny bit of motion blur is not bad for the experience. Vanya says 1080p is boss for me. Uh, I'm I can't do 1080p even on a small display. On my ultra wide monitor, my 34 inch ultra wide monitor, I do 1440. That's my my base standard. That's actually just my choice. Like I don't I don't care about 4K. Um, I refuse to fuck with 1080p. 1440p is my my perfect option and then just max out that frame rate after that baby that's what i want that's my go-to that's my choice and the good thing about pc is that they give you those choices on console not so much i wish that they would expand upon the decision making process when it comes to how you want to play games on, on the console i think that would be amazing and then just have the recommended for those that don't really want to fuck with that. Like the, the main three recommended options. And then just leave that shit open for other motherfuckers that really want to kind of, you know, customize shit to their liking. Because everyone's different, you know? I mean, technically 8K is capable even on the PS5 now. Um, Who's saying that? Uh, Dwayne, te technically, is eight. The, the systems now are 8K capable. Supposedly, you ain't never gonna really see that unless it's like a super indie game, and those indie games don't care about displaying at that resolution to begin with. You could do 1080p. Uh, I'm good on 1080p, bro. I I don't have high standards, but I still have standards. I mean, if you do 1080p, I ain't mad at you, though. On a small display, it's not so bad. But, um, on a fucking 65-inch 4K television, I don't want to see 1080p, personally. Sasha says, I got a 4070 Super, and I play at 1080p. I got used to it for many years. I mean, hey. But the thing is, the 4070 Super is fucking... That shit built for 1440p, though. But, I mean... That's, what, that's what's beautiful about the PC, though. You have your options, and that's what you prefer, and I ain't mad at you. Do you use Discord? Yeah, I have a whole Discord. Um, IJ. I have a whole Discord. Server and... Uh, I don't have it public because uh, we got haters out here. But, um. I just have it so that, you know, basic dollar membership gets you instant access. Like, just, just to keep the riffraff out at the end of the day. Because we got fuck shit motherfuckers that, that want to pull up, you know? And I'm just trying to avoid that shit. Like, if y'all ain't. If y'all ain't fucking about being chill. If y'all ain't here because, you know. If you're here to fucking hate, fuck off, you know? That's why I just have it locked behind, like, a dollar paywall. A dollar ain't breaking nobody, and it, it don't do nothing for me at the end of the day. A dollar is a dollar, but just to show that y'all y'all fucking with me, like, you know.
Marlon's Discord fell apart on some crazy shit. Does he have it hope open to anyone? Or do you have to be a channel member to get in there? See, that, that's why it's like, bro, like, I just don't want to deal with the fuck shit. I'm not good at telling people to behave. Like, I shouldn't have to do that, first and foremost. And I don't like telling people what to do to begin with, you know? Like, it is rare when I go out of my way to tell motherfuckers what to do. Y'all know me. At the end of the day, I'm not your fucking mother. I ain't about that shit, you know? So, like, just making sure, you know... I avoid letting fuck shit bitches into my Discord. I just got that dollar membership. It's members only, but you got help. Yeah. Yeah. That's what it is when, man, when you got, you know, you got the clout and shit. You're going to have a lot of people in there, and even some of them, some of them been fucking with you for a long time. Some of them kind of turned on you. Like, I, I can understand Marlon's perspective on that. You know, it, it sucks. But, um, oh my god, I take fall damage? Fuck! Is too low. Try using the plank. I can't afford to take fall damage. What are we doing here? What is this? Oh shit. We got under here. Oh shit, hold up, hold up. Oh my god. They need to get, like, this camera with the... They need to get this camera right. I can't, I can't jump over this? Can I jump over here? You're telling me she can't fucking, bruh. She can't get over that. That's crazy. Alright. What the fuck? What, what the fuck? Did I fuck this up? Hold on. Oh, we got right here. There we go. Ready to say. What are we doing here? Oh, there we go. And there's stuff down there that I need to get my hands on. Um, Clarence, we're just playing a demo, bro. Um, I wish I had the game. Shift up, call me, bro. Man, this shit over there, too. What's the difference between 4K and Blu-ray? A lot more, uh... So essentially, 35mm is about 8K, if I'm not mistaken. So, when you have 4K, we're really close to the intended vision, visually, that creators, like, when it comes to film, intended, or they saw, you know? That's what we're close to when when we're at 4K. We're super close to that visual quality that's on actual legitimate film. Yeah, I'm a fucking nerd when it comes to that shit. Oh my god. I'm a super nerd when it comes to that shit. Like, that's why I'm so fucking passionate about 4K film. I was bitching um, this morning that True Lies like looks like shit in 4k because fucking what's his name stupid ass James Cameron's stupid ass he wanted to fuck up the visual quality of, of of his films when he released them. He does like this AI correction shit to his films and they look like ass. It's fucking depressing. It's like, bro, we don't need this weird AI correction that you keep doing to your films. How about just having the genuine visual image? That's what people fucking want. Like, you don't have to make a fucking film made in the 90s and 80s look like it's modern. That's not the point. Keep the intended visual image of that time period. It's a- like, your films are a period piece of their time. What- what's so- 
Like, just because you're an old motherfucker, you don't have to try and make your films feel like they came out more recently. Fucking idiot. James Cameron is a fucking retard. Not for nothing. He literally out here fucking up his films, making true lies, making the the people in true lies look like fucking plastic dolls and shit. Fucking asshole. Yes, Criterion is amazing. And I know I know like motherfuckers be like Criterion chills and shit, but there's a reason for it, man. Criterion's pretty solid. Oh my god. You're a nerd, period, pretty much. I'm rocking with the LG C155 inch. I'm not upgraded for years. Uh, Kilotone, I'm there with you, but I I went with the more um cost friendly uh, choice. I went with the High Sense UAG 65 inch. I got a bigger TV for a cheaper price. It has all the modern features. It's just not an OLED, and to be honest with you, I don't want to be bothered with a fucking o with the OLED experience to begin with. Um, at least on my TV, I wasn't. I'm good. Uh, I don't want to deal with burning, even though, even if it's not necessarily as much of a prominent thing as before. Yo, son, are we serious right now? Oh, fuck! This bitch got me again! Oh, my God. Fucking asshole. Fuck you! Piece of shit, motherfucker. Well, I'm about to die because I'm, I'm very mad with that. With my performance there. Alright, maybe I won't die. I, I kind of made up with it. By angry attacking that starfish motherfucker. Fall damage is no joke. Yo, you ain't lying, bro. Oh my god. Fall damage fucking sucks in this game. Yeah, we still fucked up with that. I thought maybe. Just maybe. Do I keep all the stuff that I've investigated already? Alright, that's good. Yo, Crow, what's good, my man? Hope you're doing well. We out here, um. We out here struggling, baby. Be struggling but having fun at Stellar Blade is quite a bit of a challenge and I'm appreciating it. But um I like my high sense because it has all the modern features, it has VRR support, it has like the the con like the, the gaming features that I need. So gives you like those um warnings to back the fuck up no match for your skin suit yeah he had james cameron is a major fuck up with 4k he is such a major fuck up with it I, I ordered Aliens because Aliens happens to be the least problematic of of his films that have come out in 4K thus far. But he's even fucked up Aliens a little bit too with that smoothing. This is not how you modernize films, bro. Just make the visual quality pristine and keep it moving. It's, uh, it's really unfortunate, but what are we gonna do, right? How, I, how do I get up here? Can I climb those things over there? Those little pillars that they got? I don't think so.
I like that little spine uh, thing that she has on her bodysuit. Or her lack thereof. Her More like her birthday suit. Can I get up here? Yeah, I ain't getting up here. And I took... No, I don't think I took ball damage. I just suck. Oh shit. Alright, alright, got a little bit of bread. Let's go. Are these chicks synthetics? Um, I don't think so because I watched a character die and she was definitely bleeding regular blood. I guess they're just like humans in advanced suits, it seems like. I actually didn't put it- I, I actually- I don't know if this is considered a suit, technically. Oh my god. Damn, I still took damage! Fuck! Man, this game fall damage shit is kinda- They're in fuck- Is it because I'm not wearing a suit that she's taking fall damage? I wonder. Because if you're like a super, like you're a human in a super suit, you would think that the suit would take that, you know, would ease that fall. But I guess not. Oh fuck, no! Oh my god, I hate my life. I did it again. I did it again! She had a metal skeleton, her, her bone was metal. Alright, coach. Appreciate you hanging out with us, fam. Have a good day. Take care of yourself, bro. I'm sad. I am a sad bitch right now. Think, yo, what's good, Red Chaos, first and foremost? And he's saying to think this is the game that makes people insane. Oh shit. Move, move. And like, the game is nothing crazy. I mean, besides like the characters looking like the. You know, the good guys looking, like, attractive, you know, like, that that's the only thing about this game, and it's made people upset. Like, companies out here reinforcing, like, policies on how they think characters should look now and shit. Like, bro, we, we fucking take, we take notice to this shit. It's not just Microsoft, too, that, that was like, yeah, um, devs, you should make sure your characters, you know, look a certain way like they're not the only ones doing this shit guys but yeah there's there's definitely a lot of characters since this game has become a thing Reinf there's a lot of companies starting to reinforce how they think their characters should look and we fucking notice so fuck y'all bitches for that first and foremost But this is this is really nothing new. This is shit that, you know, fucking uh, sixth and seventh gen was completely normal, and it is normal. There's nothing wrong with this. But motherfuckers gotta act like fucking loser ass prudes. How do I like? Yeah, this yellow paint. My thing is, how do I go down here? Pause. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. No. Can I can I hang off the edge? Oh my god. I fucking hate this shit. Yeah, this shit was the normal 360 era. There was nothing wrong with this. Now all of a sudden there's something wrong with it. Man, y'all are fucking prude ass bitches, bro. Like, fuck. Fuck these game companies, man. Like, they're fucking dog shit. Not for nothing. Fuck them. Acting like people are evil because, oh my god, we want we want video games to be the way they used to be. You're, well, you're evil motherfucker for wanting that. Like, yo, go fuck yourself. Not for nothing, bro. Like, honestly, what like that's what needs to be said. Like, if you got a problem with shit like this, it, shit that ain't even nothing crazy, like, go fuck yourself. Yeah, that's why I'm buying this game twice. Even if I think the game is just okay, I'm still buying it twice. It's a, it's a fucking statement. You better start making cool ass or, or attractive ass characters. Otherwise, you expect to fail. Ex yo, we have to. Like, it's important to tell developers, like, yeah, we want games that appeal to us and you'll get money. Even if we have to go to the Korean devs for it. Because Western developers, they think they too good for that. That's, that's literally what's disgusting about it. They really, really genuinely think, genuinely think they're too good for this. And it's like, y'all ain't good, you're fucking trash. Fucking wise the fuck up. Like, what do they have, uh, what do they got going for them that's better than this? Exactly, Dwayne. Why is uh, a digital world so offensive to them? These people genuinely just hate gamers. Like, they hate gamers. They hate what gamers want. They avidly show that they just have this disdain for the people that they want to sell video games to. And we keep demanding them to address it. Like, address the situation and they keep just trying to avoid it. And trying to force other game creators to adhere to their fucking bullshit ass ideology. And we're against that shit. Like, if you have a problem with this, bro, and look, man, y'all know me. I'm a fucking tomboy. Like, I don't dress like this. I don't look like this. I don't have a problem with this. You know why? Because I'm not a fucking loser. I'm not someone that's like, oh, man, I have to be mad because Eve, a, a digital character, looks like this. Like, I don't have any problems mentally with myself to where it's like, oh, man, I don't look like this, so I have to be upset because there's female characters in video games that look like this. No, there's nothing wrong with this. If a woman looks like this, that's not a problem. I I'm comfortable with myself. I'm not a fucking loser like these fat bitches and, and these fucking, uh, fucking fanboy motherfuckers that identify as females. Like, they have a problem with themselves, and that's why they have a problem with this with characters that look like this. Me, I don't have a problem. I'm not ashamed of myself. Motherfuckers out here are ashamed of themselves, but demand to be respected by other people. First off, stop being ashamed of yourself. Alright, so where are we at here? Lightning Rush. Increased charging distance and attack power of Rush. And then we got Rush Chain. Okay, let me get that chain. What is this? Hitting the enemy in the air, then Lance ignores the enemy guard. Hmm. Yeah, let me get that too. Oh, I can't. Oh, okay. So this cost me 2 SP, I'm thinking? Oh yeah, this one cost me 2 XP. Yeah, if a motherfucker got a problem with how this woman looks, I'm sorry, but you're a fucking loser. 
you need to get help to, you know, feel comfortable in your own skin. Stop making your own mental issues my fucking issue. That's not, like, that's not cool. Stop making it our issue. Stop advocating for the industry to appeal to the fact that you have fucking mental issues. That you're not comfortable with yourself. I have, that has nothing to do with me. That's a you problem that you need to assess. Fuck out of here. We tired of the bullshit, bro. Yo, Seasman, thanks for, for hanging out with us. Definitely, bro. Finish up the week strong. Get Finish up work. Have a great weekend, sir. Appreciate you hanging out. Thank you, Melanie. Appreciate it. We have to go through this building. Try putting the fusion cell you have here. It does sound like a personal problem. People keep trying to make their personal problems my fucking problem or our fucking problem. That's not a thing. Like, get the fuck out of here with your bullshit. So. Oh my god, holy shit. This shield, holy fuck. Back up, back up, back up. Oh my god, yes! Damn. There is no cancel from what I'm... Oh shit, no! Alright, alright. Oh my god, back up, back up. I'm fucking dog shit at the parry system. Holy shit. Yo, legendary Yopi, what's good, fam? The fact Sony still put it out it is funny. Yeah, um, I'm, I'm like... I'm like... I'm wondering what's up with Sony because they definitely send a lot of mixed signals when it comes to video games and how women are presented in them. Um, sometimes they act like fuck shit prude loser motherfuckers and then sometimes and then now they're doing they're releasing this game so I don't know what it is like are they finally uh, put in the bag before their personal fucking uh, California viewpoints or what Sony seems to quietly been embracing it and make and making exceptions their own anime productions too. Seems like they're trying to play it safe for the West. They need to just stop listening to these fucking activist cocksuckers and just listen to gamers. Listen to people that actually make you fucking money. <laughs> yeah, I'm digging that music. It's definitely like, it gives me a a slightly more chilled back Bayonetta um, sound experience. Like Bayonetta shit used to be popping, popping like heavy extra. All right, I need to figure this shit out. This one. Oh my god, fucking hell! We out here with the growing pains right now. There we go. There we go. Oh my god, no! Alright, perfect dodge, perfect dodge. Alright, we got him, holy shit. You could definitely change outfits. There's going to be a lot of outfits in this game that you can collect, apparently. That's like a normal thing, so... Um, there's going to be outfits to, for you to choose from. Adam? What is this? Don't you know this already? It's a map. A map? 
how do you synchronize the location on the map? Playing on hard mode? Oh shit. I mean, I'm just trying to give the viewers what they want at the end of the day. That's what y'all want. Alright, fuck it. Let's put on the shield. I gave y'all what you want for real enough time. Oh shit, did we get another suit? Hold on. We got something else. I don't know what the fuck it was. Huh. Oh shit, hold on. Let me see. We got something else. Nope. Oh man. I don't know what the hell we got. I collected something. Oh. Looks like this used to be a library. Are these boxes displayed on the wall storage devices? I feel you, Clarence. So, Look, you know, I never like to tell people to what to do with their money or don't like their gaming habits. Sense. I really don't. But if you can, I think it's important to support the game. If you can. And we don't really know when Dragon Ball is, is coming out, but you know. Whatever you could do to support like artistic freedom in the space. You know, it's definitely advised to do so. If you could do it. And if you like the game, I'm not- if you don't like this game, I ain't mad at you, you know? If you like the game, try and support it. I mean, Vanya, I enjoy James Cameron movies too, like, you know, more so his- his earlier work. I really do, it's just that James Cameron acts- is a dickhead in some ways, you know? going to be difficult to pass. We'll have to go across, past the parking and tower. And guys, modern day video game companies should be fucking ashamed of themselves. This is made by a, a development studio that makes phone games. Fucking phone games, brothers and sisters. Modern day video game developers should be fucking ashamed of themselves. This is a company that makes phone games, and here we got a game that has a, a acceptable frame rate, acceptable visuals. Everything seems to be playing pretty fucking well, considering. I am I am very much um I am very impressed by the caliber of work they've been able to present since there, especially since. They make phone games. Yeah, Clarence, it's it. Modern day gaming should be Maybe fucking ashamed of themselves, not for nothing, bro. Forever. There's there's an interesting world here with interesting lore. Um, uh, there there's a lot of positives to this video game. A supply camp, in a place like this. Yeah, Razan, this supply is a game. Camp. I'm playing it on balance, and I'm quite happy it's with the performance. Set up by the airborne squad who came here before. Hmm. Looks like it's been abandoned for a long time. How come they set up a camp in a corner like this? Well, the supply camp. You're in love with the game. That's what I'll. Base. You know, that's what's up, Sway Bag. Is this parking lot important? Yep, mobile game. Mobile game developers are saving gaming. Absolutely pathetic. And I guess this place could be useful for us.
Yeah, I, I put clothes on uh, <laughs> with the character this time around, bro. Apparently, if you don't have a suit on, it's like essentially the hard mode because you're not playing with a shield. Oh shit. You could reset your whole skill tree. Oh, that's cool. I like when games give you that option. Oh, my biggest haters arrived. What's good, homie? Pulse grenade. Alright, do I have a skill point? I don't be paying attention to when I get skill points. be used on an enemy when an enemy is attempting a fatal attack. Dodge and teleport behind the enemy to attack. Ooh, okay. I like that. They give you a lot of options on how to in combat in terms of, you know, evading enemy attacks. They definitely give you a lot of decent options. Oh, you could train your skills? What? Oh. I get what they mean now. Select a skill with the kiosk to train it. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. Yeah, I was wondering how to deal with that scenario. Alright. So we guard. Come on, man. Oh shit. Yo, I love the damage that you could do on these motherfuckers. Come on, do it again. Oh shit. I really skipped training. I I'd be skipping training, but then I'd be complaining like, oh, man, my stink. Oh, so wait, is it. Am I doing this when. When they're glowing blue or when my fucking sword is going, going blue? Excuse me. Holy shit. Can't talk today. See, I'm trying to figure out. Cause I'm doing it when when your sword goes blue. I got you. See, I was doing it when the enemy has that blue shit. Nope. Hold on. I did a little bit earlier. See, that's what's a little bit confusing. But then again, uh, we have read around here. Oh, you playing it too, Nate? That's what, that's what's up. There we go. There we go. Perfect makes perfect, see? I probably would have went half the game trying to figure all that shit out. Real tough.
No, when your sword... When your sword blinks blue, that's when you hit the circle button, like, forward circle to get behind the enemy. They go blue to prepare you. Appreciate you, Razan. Alright, so that's what's up. We learned something new. Adam? Yeah? About yesterday. Thank you for saving me. You play after the live ends? Definitely have fun, man. Play the game if you like the game. That's nothing. Really. You don't have to replay this. Apparently, it carries Although over to main game, so that's cool. I, li I like when games do that. That I collected over the years. Oh. It's all right. That now means we can help each other. I totally poked my mic, so sorry about that, homies. We can track down the Alpha Nativa together, and well. I'd have trouble making it out here by myself anyway. If you can locate the Hall of Records, you'll have done more than enough. Listen, don't worry. I promise. I'll make sure to repay you. some nice music there's some stew being made bro like what more do you need it's like camping except we got a fucking vending machine with us holy shit <laughs> that's what's up man I'm digging it. It's pretty fucking nice. Damn, it's already five. Holy shit. We're just chilling though. Yo, by the way, I seen we had new channel members join yesterday. I ain't seen no new channel members join the Discord though. Uh, that's unacceptable. I need to see y'all pulled up to the Discord and hang out with us. Wait, we can call on the phone? Fast travel? Oh shit, we do have fast travel. Oh, that's cool. We can go back. I like that. I like that. I think that's the one thing about Bayonetta that... I kind of wish was a little bit different. Um, instead of the whole chapter select shit for it to be all like one, per like, forward progressing thing. Discord or that cord? I see you, Dwayne. <laughs> you have to download it? Yeah, Clarence, give it a shot, man. My Discord's pretty chill. We got like, closing in on, on 200 people. We got some homies that are on the daily. It's nothing like. It's a, a manageable Discord if you're just like kind of getting used to Discord. So it would be a dope ass place for you to hang out and we'd love to see you there. And it's a one time thing. You know, you become a channel member, you can do it for 99 cents. Instant access to the Discord forever. Just as long as, as you don't uh, be on some fuck shit. And mind you, I don't. Like, for me, uh, I, I'm really, like, chill. Like, I don't really like to fucking be all extra and shit. With, uh... With, I guess, policing and whatnot. Y'all know what fuck shit is, and y'all know what's cool. So, I always ask that homies keep it cool. Alright, so how far up can we go? There's so many different areas to go, I feel like I'm missing out on shit. Oh, we can't open it. Look! 
had Discord but deleted. Man, you gotta be in some chill Discords, man. Like, my Discord makes you not want to delete. Oh, shit. Yeah, E. Yeah, E. Make your moves, girl. Let's go. Adam, get back. Oh, shit. Whoa. Holy fuck. When it's yellow, what are you supposed to primarily do? Because I'm sure it's blinking a certain color because you're only allowed to do a certain thing. There we go. Got him. Fuck, bitch. Uh. Shit. Are we doing our thing? We doing our thing. Oh yeah, like, bro, I was, I was playing with Eve nude, and that was like not doing me any fucking favors. Oh shit! What the fuck? No! Oh shit! Oh shit, no no back up back up back up Holy fuck alright we gotta heal up right now Ooh Yeah we got him holy shit get his ass get his ass yes sir Oh shit holy fuck No 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 Alright we need to be able to like Oh my god, holy shit. Damn it! I like this music right now. Enemy designs are very nice. Um, I'm liking these fuck shit enemies. Nice. Yeah, get his ass, yeah. What the hell? What the Oh, they're showing us like a little montage? I thought I was back in it again. Holy shit. Serious seems to have happened. I have to return to Zion. Yo, I'm di bro, son. Oh my goodness. This is a fun it's game. Plants and it is genuinely birds. fun. And it's like I know motherfuckers is gonna be like, it ain't no devil may cry, it ain't no bayonetta, but who cares? Even if it's worse than all. It still seems to be pretty fucking decent yeah. in its own right. And I don't even, bruh, I haven't booted up my PS5 in so long, but I booted up for this. It's been months, dog. You gonna try and, like, it's the same shit with, like, comparing everything that's, like, samurai now to Ghost of Tsushima. Like, you're a fucking cunt. Like, just enjoy shit for what it is if it's good. This is pretty fucking solid. April 26th, baby! We less than a month away, y'all! Huh? J Dab says I'm supporting, would love to see more of this. Facts! Yeah, I got. I, I bought a physical copy of the game. Um, I'm hoping to get the digital deluxe upgrade. Hopefully, they have that day one. Because I would definitely like all the extra little things to it. 
And uh, when it comes to PC, I'll be picking it up then too. If I like the game, if I like the game or if I'm cool with it. If it's like, if it ends up being like, oh, it's, it's decent, it's decent, I'll fuck with it, I'll buy it again. If it's, if I feel like the game has replay value, if I'd have fun playing it again. Um, if the game is bad, because you never know, it's a possibility the game could be fucking terrible. If the game is genuinely bad, then nah, I won't pick it up again. But I'll either way, I'll be happy to have supported it just out of spite for the motherfuckers in the industry acting like bitches. Uh, just because bitches got some curves. But overall, I'm, I'm pleased with what I've been playing so far. I like the visuals. I like the characters. Eve is really cool. Um, she's like, she's a very subtle coolness to her. She doesn't necessarily have any slick ass remarks. She just tries to be that competent, uh, character in a fuck situation, like, with everyone else, you know? I normally like, I like my, my characters to be a little more snarky, like, like your Dantes, like your Bayonettas. But I'm interested to see what, what Eve, how Eve is as a character. Put salt on mouths for doubt in this game. Like, yeah, if motherfuckers want to be negative as fuck. I mean, y'all can kiss my fucking ass. Not for nothing. The game's pretty solid. Pretty solid. We have to see, you know. You gotta actually play the fucking game. But it's cool. It's always nice to see that they're not afraid of showing off. Of, of showing off what they worked hard on. This is a demo at least in the main game. Overall, I'm impressed. The visuals are there. The performance is there. The gameplay is there. That's more than I can say for most fucking AAA major uh, budget productions nowadays. You'll buy it twice? Yeah, if the game's solid, I'll buy it twice. So far, so good. Dante, why are we talking about 92? Bro, I, I was in... Bro, I wasn't even a... I wasn't even official in, in April, on April 26th of 92. I wasn't even like... I was about to be a fetus, but not quite yet. If Xbox releases his game, you'll play as Steve. Yo, son. This shit releases on PC, though. Shit, you'll have nude mods, like nude nude mods. You'd have fucking 120 FPS, yeah. Bruh. All the bells and whistles. You get to play as the other chick that died. As a mod, that'd be cool. Because some people digging her. And it's like, I ain't mad at you, bro. Eve is cool, and so is the other chick, too. Uh, Ta Taki. Yo, Warren, what's good, homie? Hope you're doing well. Talking about the Rodney King riots in LA. Yo, son. Are you good, brother? We, we talking about a good-ass game. We're digesting the demo of a good-ass game that's coming out at the end of next month. We had an Xbox fanboy in the chat saying it's no, it's no, it's no devil may cry. Because unfortunately, you didn't get an opportunity to play it. Sucks to suck. Sucks to be on, stuck on one platform. I don't got that problem. I got everything. But motherfuckers, that's real to gaming. Um, Yeah, there's something to be hyped about here. There's something to be excited for. It's good to see because there definitely is a lot of shit that's sus as fuck. This game is not being developed to run at 60 FPS and it shows in the performance in the performance modes. We got games that come out broken as fuck. We got games that's robbing people with microtransactions out here. This is a, a nice fucking respectable game that's seeking the, the, the player and the consumer's fucking respect. I gotta, you know, shout out to, to homies that shift up for doing their thing. Got 58 likes? Oh, shit. 
we gonna hit the big 60. Devil May Cry is a great fucking franchise. Devil May Cry 5 is a great fucking game. I beat it on PS5. I actually wouldn't mind running through it again. Might pick it up on PC sometime. You played the first DMC. It's a solid game, DMC one. I mean, if you didn't play DMC three, then you have you haven't played peak DMC. But DMC one is a great game for its time. Void listener says there's more. Okay. Is there? You know, I need to see. I need to watch the. Devil May Cry anime. Oh, boss challenge has been unlocked. Okay. Oh, so basically, I guess they let they have another mode where you have all your skills unlocked to to fight a boss. Yeah, Gamester acts like a little bitch, so. It is what it is, bro. Homie got a case of dry dick, that's why he's here. Yeah, I need to check out that DMC anime. I might actually... Hold on. Before we do this this boss challenge, let me look up and see if I can get a physical copy of that real quick. I've seen Eddie Gordo uh, from Tekken 8. I haven't checked out his, his Tekken 8 gameplay. I, Eddie Gordo is my dude from, from Tekken 3. Shout out to the GOAT of Tekken. I would do a react, but I'm streaming from a uh, from a PS5 instead of actually streaming from my PC. I'm still so um if you guys watched the the podcast yesterday, shout out to Two Real Fuse Podcast, baby. Starting two hours late yesterday, but um I actually because of you guys, I want to say thank you again. If you hadn't checked out the the podcast yesterday, I gave you guys a shout out to chat. Um, everybody who who leaves a like checks out the videos, you know, subscribe to the channel, became channel members, drop super chats. All y'all made it possible for me to get a you know an audio mixer. So obviously, you know, I, the best way to give back to y'all is to improve the quality of the streams of, of the videos in any way that I can. So I got. The Go XLR, so thank you guys for uh, giving me that opportunity, man. Uh, never, never take you guys for granted. So, and it's everybody, everybody that's watched videos, that that's left likes, that that's become channel members. It, any little thing, I very much appreciate y'all. Um, y'all really, it's all because of you. So thank you so much for that. Hey, speaking of which, Ice Queen Gaming, thank you so much. Welcome to the Cult of Cage. Thank you. I appreciate that. I don't know if you guys hear one of the dogs barking in the background. If so, my apologies. If you hear it, I'll close the door. No, thank you, Dwayne. Thank you. And thank you as well, Ice Queen Gaming. Appreciate you. Eight is really good. I, like, for me, I'm not much of a fighting game player. Like, I had, like, my time as a kid where I would play fighting games. And, you know, you'd butt mash with your homies that don't know what the fuck they doing either. Then I got internet when I was like, what in, I was, I was kinda, what was it like, it was 12, 13, 
Then you start looking up how you could actually play fighter games and you realize, oh yeah, we wasn't playing this shit right ever. <laughs> you know? I, I, I would just play them shits casually. I love the stories, all of the characters, all of the lore. Street Fighter, Tekken, Mortal Kombat. I, I played all those since I was a kid. I just didn't realize, oh shit, you could do some fuck shit in these games. Oh wow. I definitely wasn't playing them correctly. Now, I, I, I just, I like fighting games casually. I'm not one to, to really dive into it like that. No most moves? That's what's up, Clarence. Yeah, like, shout out to y'all that kill it in, uh, in fighting games. By the way, Ice Queen, I'm not sure if you do have a Discord, but since you're a channel member now, um, just check out the channel membership tab on my channel. And there's a link there for Discord if you want to join. Female gamers in my Discord uh, get a uh, final girl role. Hey, Neo, what's good with you, bro? Let me check out, see what the comment is. Hold on. Howdy, Cass. And the good folks in the chat. What did I miss? How is the demo going? Neo, the demo is solid. We still have another part of the demo to go. But, um, the gameplay is pretty solid. Takes some getting used to. The visuals are clean. Uh, the performance is good. I'm actually playing... Normally, I always go for performance mode. But... The balanced mode is actually really good because this game is designed to run at 60 FPS, unlike a lot of modern games now. So even the balanced mode is pretty on point. I actually prefer that because it does improve the visuals just a tad bit while still retaining what feels to be a 60, uh, 60 FPS frame rate. You reinstalled Killer Instinct on your Xbox? That's what's up, Warren. You like hot women and badass ones too? Hell yeah! No, that's what's up. Now, nah, Killer Instinct, man. Killer Instinct is just a hype game too. You want to play something that's got gonna get you fucking hype? But yeah, I saw that uh, they gave Eddie the infamous haircut that you don't really see many uh many black people have, but somehow become the staple of game black video game characters. Man, it's like, Eddie's his own dude, you know? Like, he's so different from everyone else. Why you fucking just go along with... With the same old fuck shit that all these other characters got? Eve, it, like, character design-wise, she, she, she has a very nice character design. Um, I like that there's gonna be a fuck ton of outfits to choose from. In terms of her character, she's very... Um, about, you know, handling business. She isn't snarky like Bayonetta is. But, um, she seems to come off as a very competent, uh, female protagonist. That, uh, that's in a fuck situation, you know? Kind of like, uh, I guess I kind of relate her a little bit to Ellen Ripley in, in some ways. Alright, that's enough of the chit chat. We go and play the uh this boss fight. Let's see what's up. Let's do the boss challenge. Yeah, I like the way her hair just drapes on her like on her body and shit. Like it you know, it doesn't clip. That that's to me that's a big fucking deal. You know how many games, even in modern days, still clip? And it's like at the end of the day I understand like, you know, it's a game. But, um, it's rare when you don't see a video game that has clipping in it. Like, I'm kind of just used to it for what it is, you know? But that that's cool. That's a little detail that I think is really nice. Hair splits, too. Yeah, like, her, the hair physics are pretty solid. And, like, the fact that there's no clipping really gives you that extra sense of, like, I don't know, I guess realisticness I wish more games would try to clean up to that level 
But um, we can't even expect games to fucking run well day one. So to ask for them to take care of clipping, yeah, it's like, bro, you find a losing battle here, you know? <laughs> You'd clip her, yo. Yeah, it does have a nice way. Oh my god, Dwayne. Maybe, perhaps, maybe that's her kink. He's hiding. Holy shit! Okay. Alright, there's a lot. Alright. Let's see. Oh shit, no! See, when it's yellow, I don't know. Maybe I'll skip the reading. Oh shit. Alright. Alright, so when it is yellow, you have to actually... Oh shit, what the fuck? Gotcha, bitch. There's a lot of, like, visual things going on that it it, it is distracting. Then again, I'm I'm very sensitive to that kind of shit. I get easily distracted. I'm a I'm a fucking pain in the ass when it comes to that kind of shit. A lot of people like all those extra visual effects, but for me, it's like it kind of gets in the way in my view. All right, so we do have gr use the grenades. Let's let's. Yeah, you're right about that, Dwayne. You're not kidding. Like, I see how these K-pop artists do. They don't fuck around. I like that you can skip the cut. Oh my god. What the fuck? God damn, hold on. Holy shit. Audio glitch? I don't know if you guys heard that on your end. Whoa. Major audio glitch. My shit cutting out. Oh my god. Alright, I need to I died. I was trying to back away so I could heal. Yo, Mitty, what's good, fam? Time to install the demo? Hell yeah, bro. Yeah, I'm at, like, this other part of the demo. Like, after you beat, like, the... After you beat the vertical slice at the beginning of the game... They, uh, they let you play, like, uh, this boss fight. Where you have more skills that you have unlocked. Hey, Ice Queen Dice, welcome to the Discord, fam. Good to have you here. Yeah, I know some Discord members, uh, I, I'd be having to check to make sure that they accepted the terms. Because some, some people jump into Discord and they don't really do that. And it's like, well, you don't have access to anything until you do that. Ziggy, get your little butt over here. Come on, buddy. Come on, inside.
trying to close the door because the doggos are running their little mouths. Right, Zigman? I got a little Ziggy in here. Ziggy says hi, chat. Yeah, it'd be nice to have a Ziggy companion in the game. There's other outfits and buffs you can mess around with, plus the gun. Huh. Oh, I'm s oh, I got you with the gun. I see that. Oh no, wait. Holy fuck. Yeah, I just spilled- I just used up all my shit. But, um, I'm trying to figure out what's what. What is R1 for, is my question. Oh, okay. 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 Let me see, can I restart this real quick? Alright, so we're just gonna have to die. Yo, L Pickle was good. I actually, yeah, this fucking shit is pretty dope, this demo. This is a solid game. This is a game that's gonna run well day one, it feels like. Fuck you, bitch. Wow. Decent damage. Decent damage. No! Oh shit, nice. God damn. Oh my god, no, I got too close! Alright, I'm getting better. I hope, bro, Midi, I hope you're right. Neo's asking, what are your thoughts on Godzilla vs. Kong, the new empire? Um, I mean, I heard it's good, which is cool. I just don't really care. Um, after seeing Godzilla minus one, I'm kind of just stolen. Like, at this point, like, bro, I need a sequel to that. Like, I need a Mecha Godzilla sequel to that. Warren, I do not have another outfit for her yet. I do like this outfit they stuck us with, though. Yo, if they, cause it's like, bro, what what went on in, in minus one? If if humanity's answer in Japan was to build Mecha Godzilla to fight God, bro, you already know, dog. Holy shit! Yo, Mr. Canoli Sasquatch, what's good, homie? Oh, fun question. Let me see. What's the fun question? 
indie game versus indie game, Cuphead, Night. Yo, them games are not fun. Them games are tough. Holy shit. I think I like Cuphead better, but I'm also dog shit at Cuphead. Yeah, I'm not a very execution... Like, perfectionist. I'm just terrible at, at perfect execution. But we try. We out here trying. But I, I love the visuals of Cuphead. It's, so, it's such a beautiful fucking game. Oh my god. Holy shit. I wonder if you can, like, perfect parry. Can't fucking see. What the hell? You wanna back up? Fine. Keep lead, bitch. Oh my god. Holy shit. Oh shit, and fucking There we go. Oh my god, no! I'm not a Oh my god, fuck. Oh my god, holy shit. Oh my god, no, I fucked it up! Yo, we fucked him up! Yeah, bro! Holy shit! Oh, oh my god, yo. Holy shit. That is dope. Yo, I like that. I love games that, that take into account style. Now, I know a few homies that's gonna fucking... Man, they're gonna eat this game up and they're gonna eat up Eve's ass. I'm just saying. Yo, that shit is fucking heat. Their presentation is very nice. Very, very nice. It's gonna take a little bit getting used to, especially with the with the controls, but they give you a lot to work with when you unlock it all. Warren says if you want to watch great Godzilla stuff, there is a YouTube channel. I sub to, I forgot the name. But the fights, oh my god, and I mean Okay. Now if you could figure that out, I appreciate it, but I'll be on the lookout for it if I can find it. Nah, that shit is heat, though. This game is pretty clean. I like that they take into account style. They make you feel powerful as fuck. Um, judging by how you play at the beginning of the game versus, like, sort of, I guess, you know, advanced stuff, like, end game, like, how Eve plays is different. Oh, yes. Dirty but clean, babe. You already know, Dwayne. <laughs> I mean, sure, you're gonna have those bitches on Metacritic that are gonna, you know, give it a one just because they can't play it. That, that's all it really is. If they were able to play it, if this was a, 
you know, if, and honestly, man, you know PlayStation paid to take the game away from, from Xbox and PC. That's what it is, because the game... Well, I can't confirm with Xbox, but the game was being developed for PC, so in the very least, uh, they paid to take the game away for PC for a certain period of time, but... Yeah, you know, you're gonna have those people that are salty as fuck and that are gonna go on Metacritic, but... I mean, I don't give a fuck about Metacritic. Metacritic is meaningless to me. Developer... I mean, um... You know, journalists, quote-unquote journalists, they fucking... They're trash. They'll probably give this game a shit score. I don't know. But it wouldn't surprise me if they gave it a shit score, especially after, you know... Gamergate 2's popped off. And they know that the people that they have this hatred for are looking forward to a game like this. So I wouldn't be surprised if they would take it out on Stellar Bleed. Like the fucking cunts that they are. Uh, policies probably would screwed them. Yeah, the game, from what I know, is not was not being actively developed for Xbox. I could be wrong. There was no confirmation of any of this shit. But I do know it was coming to PC originally, and now it's not. At least for the foreseeable future, until confirmed otherwise, but... Beta critic? Fuck yeah. You already know. Philly? Who's Philly? Philly said he wants ugly characters in games. I want ugly characters in games, but I want to kill them. It's really that simple. Like, there's ugly motherfuckers in Stellar Blade, but guess what? You're killing them. The attractive, the visually appealing, the cool-looking characters are the good guys, as they should be. Ugly motherfuckers belong as enemies. I'm not saying to not have ugly... If you want to have characters that that, are, that represent you in games, then you, and you an ugly motherfucker, then, you know, you could be a villain. That's fine. Phil Spencer, he wants ugly characters in games. I mean, Phil Spencer looks like a fucking thumb. Not for nothing, bro. Phil Spencer looks like the motherfuckers from Spy Kids. So, yeah, he could play a villain, too. Fucking idiot. Motherfucker, motherfucker's forehead gets bigger every time we see him. And there ain't nothing in that fucking big ass forehead either. Yeah, ugly motherfuckers belong as villains. If they want to be represented. That's just what it is. How does anyone get the basic concept wrong? Yeah, it's like we've had decades upon decades of the establishment that ugly motherfuckers, villains, good-looking motherfuckers, or cool-looking motherfuckers, they, they need to be the heroes, the good guys, or at least the characters you're playing as. Yeah, Clarence, we're not supposed to see ugly superheroes. Now that's becoming more of a prevalent thing. Yeah, maybe it will come to PC. Then I'll buy it again. You know? Now, if this was like a mega corporation, I don't know how I'd feel about it. But, um, shipped up, you know, up and coming devs out of Korea. They're killing it with with the gameplay, with the visuals, with the fucking, the performance. Yeah, they, they deserve my money twice. And if this is like a, a solid 12 to 15 hour experience that's to the fucking point, that's badass as fuck, like, that, that hits all the things that I want out of an action hacking slash game, then, you know, take my money twice, fuck it. I'd rather give it to them than these fucking uh, billion dollar corporations that make some fuck shit ass game where you're playing as an ugly bitch and, and you're playing as a you're playing through a game that's 
fucking 40 hours and should only be 10. That's what a lot of these games have turned out to be. Got us a victory, Neki. Yeah, that's the, the mobile game they made. Yeah, I was saying, midi early, I was saying, yeah, like, we've established, like, we've come to the point where mobile game developers are making better video games than, than the console and PC gaming industry, bro. We're here now. This is how pathetic, this is how pathetic modern gaming is. Ninja Kumi? Kumai? Isn't that a PS2 game? Where you play as this little dude that's a ninja? I could be wrong. I gave up with gaming mostly, now I just watch others play. I mean, there's good stuff out here, Dwayne. Just gotta look for it, you know? I hope something inspires you to pick up a controller or go mouse and key again. This stuff out here. I can't imagine myself ever giving up gaming personally. I mean, I I've always left it up to the possibility I may go retro. What is your first reaction when Bayonetta first came out? Bro, I, honestly, when Bayonetta first came out, I didn't pick it up. I didn't pick it up. I didn't pick it up until it came to the Wii U. Then I got Bayonetta 1 and 2 together. I saw Bayonetta 2 and I was wowed by it. I was like, yo, this shit is cool. Like, these motherfucking characters are dope as fuck. The main character's dope. And I saw that they were putting out a bundle release with Bayonetta 1 and 2 together I immediately bought it day one there was only like a handful of copies of the game at, at my local GameStop brought it home immediately started playing Bayonetta 1 beat that shit went up to Bayonetta 2 loved it loved it man it was something about Bayonetta 2 that won me over the the visuals um I like how they balance you know bright vibrancy with some dark looks to them like from a visual standpoint, the design of Bayonetta 2 is, uh, it's alluring. Very, very nice. Some of Platinum's absolute best work. Me too, Mitty. I'd be more, I'd be more inclined to give Bayonetta 3 a genuine try if it was on PC, because at least it'd run at a fucking reasonable frame rate. I played Bayonetta 3 for, like, two, three hours, and I said, nope. Bayonetta 2 deserves to be on other platforms. It's a great fucking game. It's not like... And, and it's not like... It's not like Nintendo has anything to lose by porting it to PC as well. Like, they don't have anything to lose by that. It's already on PC anyway. I'd rather give them money for it. You know? I'm not opposed to awarding good work. Bayonetta 2 is great. This is what the game reminds me of. Yeah, there's definitely some of that. There's some. There's definitely some inspirations from Bayonetta. Some inspirations from DFC. And it's also trying to be its own thing while being a solid hack and slash game. Like um, I'm digging it. I de there's definitely some inspirations from Nier, but it's it is trying to put it together in its own way too. You know. Guys, if you haven't tried it, you got a PS5, download the demo. Give it a shot. Let me know what y'all think. If it be on Twitter or in the Discord or in my YouTube comments. Let me know what y'all think. But if you haven't, hit the like button. Oh man, my vape died.
been playing my Switch, PC, and Xbox. Part 3 is really good. Bayonetta 3, you think Bayonetta 3 is good? Clarence said, let me see. Fun question from Neo. Lord Croft from Tomb Raider versus Bayonetta in terms of character, not, uh, not who would win in a fight. I'm... OG Lara definitely is up there with Bayo. I'm not gonna lie, I gotta give it to Bayo, man. I love Bayonetta. I like the lore. I love her character. I love her smart remarks. I love her style. Alright, Mitty. Finish downloading the game. Bruh, enjoy that shit. Enjoy that shit, man. It's fucking dope. Uh, occasionally I vape by man. Occasionally. I don't have any, like... I don't have any addictions. Besides the gaming. But occasionally, occasionally I have a cigarette. Occasionally I have a vape. Occasionally I have a drink. I just don't have an addictive personality, though. Being in the winds. Th that's how I feel personally, but if you choose... If you choose OG Lara Croft, you're not wrong. You're acting like Guy Sensei, you know? I like vaping sometimes because it clears my fucking sinuses. Sometimes I have a hard time breathing through my nose. It's kind of annoying. It's annoying when you can't fucking breathe. I don't know if y'all been there, but... The game is what helped help me get through the hard times. Facts, Clarence. The, the hardest point of my life was when my grandmother died. I was 23. And, uh... Yeah, that was like... That was genuinely, like, the hardest point in my life. Like, my grandmother was, like, my number one. So, um... And she was in a situation where she kind of just went into, like, a comatose state. And, uh... I remember, like, just being at that point where there's nothing you could do for her just had to wait for her to you know sadly pass away bro that took a whole week imagine being in that shit for a whole week you gotta wait for your you know your loved one to to pass away and, and that can happen at any moment and that shit lasted a whole week tough times man all I could do was just obsessively play video games and try not to cry so much. So I just like obsessively played Overwatch because Overwatch had come out that week. At the beginning of that, that stage that I was going through and I just obsessively played that and obsessively played The Witcher 3. And then after, you know, the shit went down, you know, I just kept playing those games until it kind of... You know, during the grieving process. So, now I know what you mean, bro. Uh, there's nothing else I, I could think of to do. You know? Oh, yeah, Clarence. Uh, it is what it is, though. Not to bring down the chat. It, it's been years, you know? But, um,. Yeah, man, gaming gets you through the good times and the bad times. It happens, man. No, no life, is, no life is a perfect life. We take the blows as they come, and we take the successes as they come. Warren, what's the Godzilla channel, fam? What's the name of it? I'll search it right now. If you haven't, guys, hit the like button. Appreciate y'all hanging out with me.
Yep, all we can do, guys, is just make the best of life while we got it. And do what the fuck you want to do, just make sure you handle your business. That's all I can say. Hey, we hit 70 likes. Thank you guys, man. Y'all fucking beasts. Thank y'all so much. It was a fun stream. It's a fun stream. I, I have fun. I hope you guys have fun. It was a good discussion. Y'all make it a dope ass time. So appreciate y'all for that. Yes, sir. 70 likes. Y'all killing it. W stream. Appreciate you, I man. I will definitely, I'm picking up this game. Comes out, what, the 26th? Definitely picking it up. Like I said, if you have a PS5, download it. Give it a try. If you don't like it, that's fine. I know, like, hack and slash games are not as popular as I think they should be, sadly. But it is what it is, man. It's, it's a fun-ass game, though. It's a fun game. I like the look of it, man. I like that post-apocalyptic shit they got going on. I've always been a sucker for that kind of stuff. Bye, Clarence. Take care of yourself, bro. Appreciate you hanging out with me. Hanging out with me, hanging out with the chat. Uh, Warren, if you haven't, just um, leave a comment on one of my recent videos on the Godzilla channel, and I'll check it out. Appreciate you looking that up for me, though, bro. Any plans for April Fool's Day? <laughs> Um, not really. Preferably not to get fooled. So there is that. But guys, appreciate y'all hanging out. Have a great safe weekend. For real, I mean that. Have a great weekend, guys. Now you have ponies listening. They'll pick up the game. I have all sorts of uh, gamers that follow me because they know I'm, I'm real about shit. They know I'm real about shit. So it don't matter what walk of life you come from when it comes to your gaming experience, y'all pull up to my, my streams, my channel, because I keep it real across the board. Thank you, Dwayne. Appreciate you hanging out. Xavris, thanks so much. Dante, appreciate you being here. Clarence, much love to you, Neozoic. Appreciate you as always. My boy, I'm in Richard Swag Lord. Shout out to you, homie. Got Light Shadow Onyx. Always appreciate you. Warren, appreciate you. Undisputed Nate King. Mitty, my man Mitty. Appreciate you being here, bro. Hope you're doing well. Swag Bag. Let me see, I'm trying to get everyone, I'm trying to do my best to acknowledge thee. But for real guys, if I missed you, it's not at all intentional. Take care of yourselves, have a great weekend, be safe out there. And keep it gaming, man, keep it gaming. Or there's good weather now, if you're, you know, certain part, at least where I'm at. I'm in, uh, you know, the northeast, so the good weather is out here. So enjoy that, if you want to, go touch the grass if you want to. Play video games if you want to, do whatever the fuck you want to do. And yeah, guys, with well, that being said, hit the, hit the subscribe, hit, hit the like, and I'm out. Peace!